first we'll straighten the page up and if I put some guides in always use guides though they're exactly for this sort of purpose so there's a couple of vertical guides if I look at the heading on the pa page maybe we'll put one there and it gets better towards the bottom of the image I'll use this unified transform tool and if this is in the way we can detach it with that little upward pointing arrow I'll do that because I'm going to work on the top right corner and the little central part of that is a trapezium deform so click in the center right on that little page and you can draw that out I would go that way out over rather than bottom and in over until you get looking at that guide those little part of it in line and then for the for the title of the page you can drag it down a little bit checking that the vertical is still okay now I can transform it and get that looks like that overall for this badly bent table all I can suggest is using a GMIC tool called interactive warp first I'll make a selection just to concentrate the tool in a specific area the selection then GMIC or gimmick it's called put a search in for warp because I want this under deformations warp interactive just leave the defaults to points because we're going to add our own and I can click and drag this out to a, a larger size and the interactive warp works by moving points around and I'll for each little rectangle I can move the pixels about inside it like that and you do need a steady hand here and if you've got a screen ruler that helps to keep everything straight but otherwise you need to do it by eye for each little rectangle we'll adjust it and I'll cut a little bit out because it's and see what we're doing so we get onto the very badly warped bit at the end and we it's the same thing you can adjust it like that maybe go back into just some more for those intermediate bits I can subdivide like that, draw those down, pull that up, pull that down. It all depends how keen you are to get this square. Never going to be wonderful. Maybe partial barcodes. Pull that up a little bit. And we'll say OK. Now I can go and get rid of the selection. Select none. Get rid of the guides. Image menu guides. Remove the guides. And because we've got a bit of transparency there. Just go into the layer menu, transparency, move the alpha channel and that will put the, the white page. So your page would look like that. 